So you know, of course, it's Memorial Day, but do you know how and why it's a holiday? Good question. WFNY News 2's Brian Bennett unravels the history. Memorial Day and Veterans Day, two days that honor those who have served and those who still currently serve our country. Today, we honor Memorial Day, but sometimes the lines can get a little blurred between the two. Simply put, Memorial Day honors those U.S. military members who have passed away, while Veterans Day honors the service and sacrifices of all American veterans on behalf of their country. Originally, Memorial Day was known as Decoration Day, which was a tradition of decorating the graves of fallen service members. Its origins are rooted in the Civil War. The first high profile memorial event was held on May 30th, 1868 at Arlington National Cemetery in Washington, DC. Due to the fact some states still choose to recognize Memorial Day on May 30th. However, in 1971, federal lawmakers changed the National Observance Day to be the last Monday in May. They also made sure that they would honor military members who died in any American wars, not just the conflict between the North and South. All right, guys, pretty straight and to the point there. Uh, I actually learned a little things as well, a little couple extra tidbits. Uh, if you want more information on Memorial Day and Veterans Day, uh, you can log on to WFNYNews2.com. But for right now, we're going to get into these tag boards. Uh, this comes from people from all over, celebs, organizations. So we're going to kick it off with the Greensboro Police Department, who says, Today we remember and honor all who have paid the ultimate price for our freedom. Happy Memorial Day. Moving along, this one comes from uh, an Instagram user who says, remembering those who have lost loved ones while serving, I see you, I'm here for you, praying for those that are having a difficult time today. And lastly, Chris Jenner says, today we remember the heroes who have fallen, the brave men and women who sacrificed their lives for our country and our freedom. We honor them today and thank them and their families, hashtag, Memorial Day. So um, I really do believe that everybody pretty much summed that up uh, really nicely. Uh, just for us to be right here on this set, for me to actually be able to go home, see my daughter, see my family every day, people put that on the line just for us to be able to do that. So I think it's good that we're you know honoring them and we should honor them every day, not just on days like this and Veterans Day. I think it's a big deal too to honor the families, right? Because the people that gave their lives they gave that ultimate sacrifice, but those friends and family members, they their lives were changed forever. So I always think about the families as well. That was the point I was going to make as well. But I think this year is just amazing that we're able to gather together in person because mm -hmm. we know a lot of events were put on hold last year or modified virtually sure. in some way. So to really be able to be there with your friends and family to celebrate and mark this holiday is a great thing. Yeah, absolutely. I guess for the veterans and, and you guys as family, um, you know, what do they talk to you guys about the most? You know, is, do they reflect often or? I think, I think that's a, a good point, uh, Brian, as well. No, I just, I think everyone has either someone in their family or social circle that has mm -hmm. served in the military. And this day is so, so important to them and it should be important to all of us. Uh, and, and to uh, Lauren and uh, Tanya's uh, point, uh, this didn't just, this affects families and friends and so if you do know a, a veteran make sure that you know you're checking in on them making sure that they um, are, are doing okay uh, with this uh, certainly a very heavy day uh, for them and should be for all of us. I just thank you to all the veterans that are still with us and thank you for all of those that given, gave their life for us like my great uncle uh, Uncle Willie we just appreciate everything you've done your sacrifice I've, even though I never met you I heard you were a great man, and I know you were a great man because of the things that you were able to give for our country. Definitely, definitely, guys.